In this video, we will see how to push all your project files to the GitHub repository using the command line. So GitHub is a best place to collaborate and share your files with others. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to push all these files to the GitHub repository using the command line. So for this, first we need to create the repository in the GitHub account. So this is the dashboard of the GitHub. If you don't have an account, you can sign up. This is a very simple process. After you sign up and log in, the dashboard will look something like this. So to create a repository, just click on this new button here. Just give a name for your repository. In this case, I will be type. So just scroll down and click on this create repository. For the first step, we just navigate to the folder where the files are located. So open your command prompt in this folder. So just copy the location of this folder and open your command prompt and use the cd command to navigate to the folder. Now we are in the weather web app folder. So use the dir command to see all the files. As you can see, these are the files that are present in the folder. For the next step, you need to initialize a git repository in your project directory using the git init command. This will create a hidden folder called git that tracks the changes in your project files. So just type git init. This will create a folder called git. As you can see, this is a hidden folder. This folder is used for all the changes in your project directory. Third step is we need to add all the files to the staging area. In this stage, let's add all the files you want to push to the staging area using the git add command. So if you want to add all the files, you can use the git add and pull stop. This will add all the files to the staging area. So just press enter. You can use the git set as command to see what are the files are added. As you can see, all the files are in green. So this means all the files are added. Once your files are in the staging area, it's time to commit them. A commit is like a snapshot of your project at a certain point in time. So use the git commit and along with the minus m flag to add a commit message. So git commit use the minus m flag to, to add a commit message. So I will type initial files as a commit message. So just press enter. Before we push our changes to the github, we need to link our local repository to the github repository. For this, we need the URL of our GitHub repository. Here we have the URL of our GitHub repository. So just copy this command here. So this is our URL of our GitHub repository. So this command will link our local repository to the GitHub repository. So just copy this command and paste it here. So finally, it's time to push our changes to the GitHub using the git push command. So git push minus u origin is equal to master so just press enter as you can see all of our files are now uploaded to the github repository so let's refresh our page to see if the files are now updated as you can see now our files has been updated to this github repository so this is how you push the project files to the github repository using using the command line so this is for this video and i will meet you in the next one